What is up you guys? It's Charles here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today guys, I have another unboxing. So this package is from Jiggered Fingerboards. So Jiggered Fingerboards is a fingerboard company here in the Philippines. They started selling like lock nuts, foam tapes, and now they're selling decks and setups. So he sent me this package so I can try them out and review the decks. So before I do that, I would just like to give some shoutouts to the people who commented on my last video. Shoutouts to Hailey Surio, Ken underscore FB, Sean Fabelia, Florence Toma Cruz, Dexter Ed, who is my cousin, Jasper Movido, James Almuete, Thomas Tarnopolsky at ER3 Clef to Francis Edel, who is my classmate, and shoutouts Carl Petes, who is my classmate as well. He just wanted to have a shoutout. So, yeah, let's open this package and let's see what we got. So, I saw photos of his line, of his new line, which is new graphics, new packaging. They look really, really sick. Uh, I would like to get some and he hit me up and yeah let's go he also sent this including this um envelope i don't know what it's called but that's really dope because here in the philippines when you buy some fingerboards you, you will just get it in a ziploc bag this is a nice upgrade so this dude never stopped upgrading his stuff he started from blanks and now he's on real wear graphics he used skate graphics to transfer the graphics to his fingerboard decks that is really nice this is what's inside the package so first we got this triggered this is a new triggered sticker and what else we got and then a small one right here so let's pull the decks out and let's see how great the, the decks and the packaging are. So here's the first deck. The packaging on this one is really dang good. It has a seal right here which is like a signboard on jeepneys here in the Philippines. So he used that to kind of use the Filipino culture as the packaging of his decks so here's the first deck which is the Intoxity graphic and here is oh damn this is my deck this is for my girlfriend right here and this is the deck he gave me dude this graphic is really nice dang so Here's the difference between the seals. This one is a yellow one. I can see it well. And this one is a is a black one. So yeah, let's open the decks up. And yeah, I'm really excited about this decks. Really. After you break the seal or after you open it you open it like this and then like this so it has here like salamat right here and thank you on the bottom so if if a foreign guy buys triggered product products you will kind of know uh, the language of, of the Filipino language and on the back, it says 100% fresh, handmade from the Philippines. It also has the Instagram and Facebook. I will put that on the description box below. So, made for your fingers. Para sa, para sa iyong daliri. So, here's the deck. And when you open it up like this. Libre, free stuff. So here's the free stuff right here. So it it is two sheets of foam tape and some 
thicker so the way you will get the deck is you will just pull it and then up just like that and then bro this deck is really nice uh, yeah I'm really stoked about this one the graphics is really there this is the top tier graphics use skate graphics use the same way a skate graphic is placed on a deck it is the same procedure so the wear on this deck is going to be really nice so let's open this one up and because these are different shapes this is the fu shape which is the regular shape of triggered which is i guess 98 millimeters medium kicks and a bit of a low to medium concave so let's open this one which is the ck shape which is the shorty shape or the short deck of triggered fingerboards same stuff two sheets of foam tape and some stickers Dang bro, this graphics are really nice. So this deck is a bit it's a bit shorter than the first one. The kicks are a little bit higher than the first one. Like here. The one on the bottom is the FU shape and the one on the top is the CK shape, which is the short shorty shape. It is 96 millimeters long and both of these are 33 millimeter wide so seeing the holes on this deck the holes are pretty much perfect it is well countersink the roundings on the deck can use a little bit more I like decks which are rounded a little bit more than regular decks so just some sanding on the sides will do well the graphics are really well placed yeah the graphics the deck is pretty much amazing the shapes are really nice these are the shapes I use kind of medium kicks and just some mellow concave which are really nice um, I will set this one up and let us try this deck yeah And we're back. I've, I've set up the board with, with some Block River trucks and some Flat Face BRR Edition wheels. So open, using the deck for a while, the shape is really dang great. This is the first time I transitioned from my old deck to a new deck and a new shape and I'm already comfortable about it. This shape is really nice. It suits my style. It suits my standards. For, in terms of shape i really like the low concave with the medium kick dude this is just a great deck the shape is really nice you can't argue anything about it but a little bit roundness on the deck should be there it's a bit boxy for me compared to this i love deck right here the uh, deck is pretty much the same length and width but the roundness on this deck is really much rounded this deck is a bit boxy I hope you guys can see it as well but that doesn't mean it is not a great deck it is a really nice deck uh, I can't find anything bad about it just some roundness on the edges and the roundness of the nose maybe it's just me but other riders like this kind of roundness on the nose it is really easy for kind of kick flips because you have a bigger nose so you can flip much better and for, on the other hand i didn't set this one up because this is my girlfriend's deck she will get mad at me if i set this up but i'm sure that this deck will also perform great because the shape is not really different from each other this might be a better shape because the concave on this one is much better than the FU shape 
So if you're a guy who wants mellow deck, which has a mellow concave and a medium kick decks, you should get this TK shape rather than this FU shape because this FU shape doesn't have that much concave on it but it's not a bad thing a lot of people like low concaves so I don't have anything else to say but big thumbs up for Matthew who sent this deck for me and for my girlfriend uh, the packaging is really nice it symbolizes a lot from Filipino culture it, before I forgot it also includes the flag of the Philippines right here on the front and everything inside is just about jeepneys and stuff because this one is like a jeepney uh, writing I will show you a sticker right here this one really represents the jeepney because it is like the jeepney signboard but this company is really great in terms of quality of the decks because he really just upgrade and upgrade and upgrade he never stops upgrading he started from blanks up to this point which is the skate graphic real wear decks which is really nice and another thing i'm a 32 millimeter user but this deck is 33 millimeters it's not that big of a change, but if you if you have been using 32 millimeters for almost four three, three years, it would be a big change. But I it didn't really bother me that much. I really love the shape of this deck, and yeah, I can say anything more about it because this is a really nice deck. And yeah, that's pretty much everything. You guys should follow triggered fingerboards on instagram and you should check their facebook page down below on the description i'll put everything down there so thank you guys for watching um if you want a shout out just comment down below i will shout you out in the next video so yeah yeah guys till next time peace out